Hey, we're in the Gospel of Luke. We're in Luke 23, today, verses 35 to 38. Jesus has been nailed to the cross, and now he's hanging on the cross. Let's take up the story. And the people stood looking on, but even the rulers with them sneered, saying, He saved others. Let him save himself, if he is the Christ, the chosen of God. The soldiers also mocked him, coming and offering him sour wine, and saying, If you are the king of the Jews, save yourself. And an inscription also was written over him in letters of Greek, Latin, and Hebrew. This is the king of the Jews. So we're going to pause there at that spot and consider the scene. What do we have? We have sneering rulers. We have mocking soldiers. So this business about if you are the king of the Jews, save yourself. That's something to think about. If you're Jesus, you did not come here to save yourself. You came here to save others. There's two kinds of love. There's self-love and there's other love. And there's different ways we can manifest that, but God is other love. God manifests benevolent goodness toward others. And so Jesus, when he came on his mission, he came, he came to die for us. And so he came to manifest other love. And then this idea that the, the thief yells at him across there says, well, if you're the king of the Jews, save yourself and save us. That's kind of self-centered, and that would be the opposite of Jesus. Jesus hanging on the cross, he's not any more, the torture doesn't make him any more inclined to serve self. He is totally on God's t team. He's, he's totally about loving others, and he's going to give his life, even for these, these criminals on the cross. Even if they never turn, he's going to give his life for them. So the idea of saving yourself is kind of alien to God. That's that's in contrast to other love. So I think that Jesus is trying to win these fellows across the line, even these guys that are being crucified right next to him. And there they all are in the last minutes of their lives. And Jesus is not going to try to save himself. He's there to save us. And there's something to pray about. Let's pray. Your Father in heaven, help us to be expressing this same other love that Jesus has. Help us to be willing and interested in, and even invested in saving others. Thank you, Lord, that, that this spirit, the mind of Jesus, could become our mind. Now, Lord, please do it. Help us to make ourselves available to you so that you can do it very fully. Thank you for hearing our prayer, Lord. In Jesus' name we ask. Amen. All right, friends. So, if whatever situation you and I are in, we want to be manifest that other love, and God will bless that.